This video will look at incorporating embedded video in your course. Most frequently this will be from YouTube. However, other online videos often offer, often offer excuse me, um, embed codes. Um, those embed codes will be used the same way as the process outlined in this video for YouTube videos. In a previous video we talked about adding web links. So that is the easiest way to uh, link out to a YouTube video and just to recap that's going to be through this plus button in the top left corner and then web link or in a content area if we want to add a link within a folder perhaps we can use build content and then web link um, the other way that you can embed um, well that both of those are linking out so it's not quite embedding the video within your course and, and I like to embed it within the course so it kind of keeps it within the context of whatever else they're studying or looking at that week. So the way I like to use embed codes from YouTube videos or other places is to use the uh, Blackboard item tool. So let's click build content and then item. We can name the video. So I know that this is um, this video that I'm going to use. Uh, I'll just pull it from here is from um, the Rhetorical Society of America and I'm gonna insert the title of the video there and then going back to our video um, when you click the share button it's gonna provide you with just a web link by default so what you have to do is click embed it gives you a code if you want them to start the video at a particular place so if it's a long video and they don't necessarily need all of it you can click the start and choose that start place um, and finally, I like to, after you've got it kind of the way you want or just by the default, you want to click copy. And that copies that code from YouTube. Then we go back to Blackboard. And just like um, we talked about in another video, the way you use these embed codes is not just to paste it in the, the text editor. The, it won't read it that way. So what you have to do is click the HTML button. And if you don't see that button, your, your text editor menu is probably collapsed, so you can expand it this way. You will click the HTML button, and that's where you're going to paste in that um, iframe or embed code. When you click Update, it'll add the yellow box, which indicates that it's ready, and um, it's not going to preview the video until we click Submit. But after you've inserted the video, you can also go beneath it or above it and add some additional text, so if you want to give them um, kind of your takeaway or what's the most important thing in that video, um, you can provide that underneath. Then you'll need to scroll down, make it available to students. If you want to track the number of views, you can. And then you'll click Submit. And what we should see is that that video has been embedded within the course. Um, I'm going to mute it for this. Um, but we'll click Play and it kind of just auto gets going and this is the normal YouTube player that you'll see most other places and so students have quick access to closed captions if they want to look at it on a bigger uh, in a bigger view they can use the full screen um, menu icon down here at the bottom right or then click YouTube and it'll take them out to the actual YouTube page um, so this is probably your best way to embed video uh, in your course and just to recap those steps the first thing that we did was click build content uh, and we chose item then when within that item we gave it a title we clicked the HTML button to paste in our code and then update and then submit